गाइज सो एज यू नो वी आर गोन बी लॉन्चिंग कंसेप्चुअल रेडियोलॉजी वेरी वेरी सून दिस इज अ प्रोग्राम विच इज इंटेंडेड फॉर द रेसिडेंट हु आर परस्यूविंग देर रेडियोलॉजी एंड आई एम गोन हेल्प यू नेविगेट इट बेटर एंड एंड होपफुली बिल्ड क्लियर कॉन्सेप्ट अलॉन्ग द वे so uh, first let's talk about how the app is going to be designed what are going to be the contents that you know we are planning to have here so now in front of you what you can see is the basic layout that we will have so one it will be the core clinical radiology which is all of the systems that you can see so we'll be talking about neuro radiology head and neck imaging thoracic radiology abdominal radiology uro rad women's imaging fetal imaging msk radiology pediatric radiology radiology and interventional radiology so these will be the heads under which we shall be discussing the different topics which are important so what these uh, these headings obviously the systems will include will be the important theory questions that we get in our exams as well as the important cases so we will be having a clinical case based approach uh, curriculum as well and then we'll also cover the theory lectures along the way right so this is about the core clinical radio apart from this we'll have a separate heading on medical physics and recent advances something that you know uh, forms a very important part of one the table viva as well as the theory there is an entire paper which is based on the physics and recent advances so we'll be covering this in detail in our recorded lecture format in addition what i think will be one of the most important highlights of the uh, app would be we'll be having ultrasound demonstration video so we'll be having experts and and you know uh, myself who will uh, be demonstrating the various ultrasound technique so this will help young residents who are in the first year the second year so the trainees uh, will get a lot of benefit in you know what are the correct probe positions what are the different windows that you can get so this is where we'll be doing demonstration videos of you know various parts so ultrasound abdomen pelvis we'll also be doing fetal imaging msk ultrasound uh, so these will be the demonstration videos apart from that another thing that i'm really excited about is the workstation so here we will be you know going through the cases so again very useful for the trainees here uh, we'll be looking at cases we'll be looking at normal anatomy normal cross sectional anatomy of different organs different parts on ct on mri you know so so here we'll be looking at images in in real time and i shall be showing you how you should approach you know reading the scans so this is something that that the first years will, will really find use in and you know we can add it up to include more and more anatomy and different cases here apart from that we shall be discussing uh, for the exam md exam particularly we shall be having classes on spotters we'll be having case discussions and we shall be preparing for table viva so this is the core uh, curriculum that i have uh, kept in mind uh, which is going to be very useful for students one who are pursuing uh, their residency who are young trainees secondly for exam going students of radiology this will be something which is very very uh, something which is going to come in very handy and also for students uh, you know who have just clear their md and are looking for a refresher i think uh, this is a win win for uh, everybody across the board so this is what i have kept in mind now the the kind of uh, approach that we are going to take here is going to be a hybrid approach right so what i have uh, kept in mind is uh, you know when i give you so much content all it once it becomes very overwhelming and it becomes difficult to finish it all so what we are going to do is a hybrid approach of live lectures plus recorded content now when i say recorded content we will put it in a staggered manner so every week you know i shall be telling you that these are the live sessions for this week and these will be the recorded lectures which will be uploaded so that way you will know uh, exactly you know how you can plan your own studies because i know you will have duties you will have a lot of things so you know you can simultaneously prepare with me and finish off these topics as we go along so we will be doing a dynamic dynamic approach of live lectures as well as the recorded content which will be uploaded in a staggered manner now again the live lectures will be mainly clinical radiology uh, lectures so that you know you can interact and you can see the cases and we can have an interactive discussion of how you would approach these cases so the live lectures would either be the interactive workstation cases that we can have or we would have clinical case scenario based case based approach and diagnostic algorithm based approach classes whereas the recorded classes would mainly be the theory questions that we get so mainly the medical physics aspect and 
some theory from the clinical radiology that gets asked in the exam, right? So this is how we are going to be approaching the live and, and recorded classes on a dynamic basis. So once we start out, so as you know, we are starting the pre-booking from 25th of December, that is Christmas, and then uh, the app launches on New Year, that is 1st of Jan 2024. So this is going to be the schedule for the live lecture. I have actually planned it till April for you. So these are going to be the lectures that we're going to have live. As far as the recorded content is concerned, I will keep letting you know how the recorded content is getting uploaded simultaneously. It will mainly in the beginning be the medical physics aspect so that the students who are appearing for the exam get benefit. In addition to these, we are also going to have spotter classes, right? So we are going to have spotter classes. We are going to have clinical case discussions here all right so these are going to be the additional live sessions that we will have so that the exam going residents can also benefit simultaneously now as you see, all of these are going to be based on scenarios. So I'm going to give you different cases. We're going to unravel how we can go about approaching these various cases, say bone tumor or a mediastinal mass. What should be the diagnostic approach that you should have? And that's why that's the main aim of keeping this live is so that we can keep it interactive and the learning is always more efficient that way. So there's a new project uh, that we're starting off and I'm very excited, uh, you know, to see all of you and to begin this new journey with all of you guys. Uh, so looking forward to meeting you soon. Um, hope we have a happy new year uh, together. Thank you so much.